This is the exhibition Artist Photonics at the Hollow Centre on Governors Island. My name is Martina Mongovius and I'm the creative director of the Centre for Holographic Arts, known as the Hollow Centre. Photonics is the manipulation of light. So if you think about electronics and electrons, you can think about light or photons and photonics. So it's a way of controlling, shaping, forming light. My name is Grant Cutler and I am an artist. Palace is an immersive Lumia piece with a generative audio accompaniment. What I like is creating the system to allow for something to happen but not dictating exactly what that's going to be. So there's this great uh, element of the surprise. It always feels new. It always is new. My name is Matthew Schreiber. I'm a visual artist and I use light in my work. So I made a hologram of a spoon, and a bent spoon actually, that was found on the property of uh, one of the homes of Aleister Crowley. What you see is a called a Dennis Yook hologram and it's very realistic and uh, it has a really wide angle of view. I've made holography on and off since 1986. So I've been staring at lasers for a long time and I always thought outside of holography, just as a, a sculptural material. And it's a whole bunch of laser diode modules that are strung together kind of like Christmas lights. And we turn all the lights out and put some atmospheric haze into the room and, and you see lasers just like you might see in a laser light show. Rainbow holograms are very attractive and fantastic. Since beginning of creation began with light, we could see the enormous nature and the world in our eyes. I searched for spirituality sublime in light. The frame to see this is like a holographic film. I started making holograms after doing a lot of experimental photography and experimental filmmaking, and I was really amazed at the control you had of the light. The thing I found was that inside the lab, it was, it was amazing, light was going everywhere, it was so dynamic, it was so alive, and then you came out with this little hologram. So I wanted to try and get some of that dynamic into my work. This is the Dragonfly Clock. My name is Elisa Balmaceda. I am a visual artist from Chile. I'm interested in how light plays an important role today. And this is actually one of the starting points of this artwork titled Radiant Threshold. So as you see, the sunlight is coming into the room and it's being projected on the surface of the material, which is LCD, liquid crystal display. So this material has the quality of changing its color according to temperature as well. So this way it's making visible, the light as heat that it's uh, being projected on it. Through my sculptures, performances and installations, I am building a symbolic library for a mythological world suspended in the post-digital era. Working with both detailed hand techniques and digital code, I create structures which capture reflect and refract light. Light is a fluid medium serving as the foundation for my artistic practice, determining how audiences interact with my immersive sculptural environments. Mm -hmm. 